All right, everybody, we're hopping into the first form cell fight with LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Now, um, I don't imagine this is going to be very difficult, but we'll see. We, we, you know, things can go awry very quickly in these showcases. So let's grab that. Let's grab this. Uh, we got pretty good key here, so that's definitely a good sign. Um, we can't get an 18 key with Gohan. Uh, I'll save the rainbow orb for next turn. Okay. There we go. Let, let's see what happens. Uh, all the attacks are on this guy, so m let's see. Okay, so he has one hit in. How do we take this super attack? Oh, we dodge it. Okay. <laughs> I mean, uh, I, I don't know what you guys want me to say. <laughs> now, he shoots out a 9.5 million attack stat right here. That's uh, certainly pretty good. <laughs> you know, 50% chance to crit and all that, right? We are type advantage in this fight. I, I played around a little bit in here. Um, I probably brought some characters that can't really hang in here, but I, I did bring, what is it, the Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, the Int one, and the Int GT Vegeta. You know, they're type advantage. I just want to see what they're doing. Like, I, I'm just curious. So, um, I brought them in here uh, j just to see. Just I'm, I'm, I'm very curious to see how they do in here. Um, you know, we, we want as many GT units around these Super Saiyan 4s as possible, uh, because they share some really powerful links, but, uh, I'm not, not too sure how they're gonna do in here, but, you know, they do at least have type advantage, so we'll, we'll see, you know, the Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, at the very least, does have the 50% chance to counter super attacks, not gonna help him against the normals, but, um, Cell doesn't attack too frequently, so, you know, I, I don't imagine that he would be subject to many attacks, as you can see here, right, like, we had a dead slot, um, that doesn't happen every turn, but I, I do find it pretty common that you can find a dead spot, a dead spot to hide units um, in. So let's see. See, like right here, there's not an attack in slot one. So we could do like this, right? And uh, put Super Saiyan 4 Goku in the middle. Um, but we're going to do this. And let's grab... We, we don't really need to be greedy and get a stack here. Um, we, we could save all these orbs in the middle for these guys who would actually need the key more. Uh... Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so let's grab that. Let's grab these with them. And then we need to get as many orbs as possible with Vegeta. There's seven. Okay, let's see how we do with seven orbs. Uh, that's quite a few attacks there at the end for Vegeta. But, you know, we'll, we'll see what happens. <laughs> uh, as long as there's not a super attack on him, I think we'll survive. I don't know. We're, gonna, we're about to find out, right? <laughs> uh, I probably should have played this rotation a little bit smarter, but... You know... <laughs> we uh we're, we're just messing around right like we have five attempts in here i'm not taking this too seriously maybe i should um but we'll see you, you know he, he has type advantage we'll, we'll see what happens <laughs> we have a lot of his good links up so you, you, you never know i'll see what happens with homeboy vegeta at the end there that, that's that's a lot of attacks as long as he's not taking 200k I think we'll be okay. Like, if he's taking, like, 120, I think we'll be fine. Okay, we do, uh, we do take a super attack here. We are guarding. Oh, 400. Okay. 50k. Uh, let's see how much this guy takes. 6.7. We'll see. I mean, this is post-super attack damage now, so... Oh, he did double super. That's good for us. Uh, that, that is certainly good for us. Let's see. Vegeta double supering. How much damage does he take from the cell? Who hits pretty hard. Uh, 68k. All right, listen. There we go. Yeah, 70. All right. So now we can revive. <laughs> uh, so let's do that. I think we're just going to win on this turn, but, you know, I mean... <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll hop in for another one just to, you know, get some more footage in here. But, I, I mean, come on. What do you expect from, like, the brand new Dokkan Fest LR who's int against this tech first form cell? Like, uh... <laughs> I don't know what you want me to say, but we, I think we need more footage of this Goku actually taking hits, uh, because so far, we haven't actually shown him taking a hit in here yet. <laughs> like, we dodged the super- I guess he took some normals, but, you know, we dodged the super attack, and then on the second rotation, there was nothing aimed at him, so, uh, not really sure what I was supposed to do there. Are we even gonna get the spirit bomb off? Like, if these guys crit, are they just gonna kill Cell? Like, wh what happens here? Okay, not quite. They didn't get an additional- uh, but now they're dead. Now we drop the spirit bomb and and we win. So, <laughs> all right, let, let's hop back in here for another run. See if we can get some footage of Goku like eating a super attack or something like that. Let, let's see what let, let's see what happens here. All right, hopping back in here for run number two. Now let's uh, let's see how this goes. Uh, again, decent opening rotations. We'll we'll definitely take that. Uh, we'll throw Goku in slot one. Lots of attacks here. Uh, we can get him up to full twenty four key, which is nice. Uh, no attacks in the middle, so no need to be greedy with these guys, but if they're just going to give me a full 24 key, I'll take it. 
Uh, then we can give Ultimate Gohan, I guess just those, that's fine. Remember that Gohan, uh, a lot of these, you know, uh, future Red Zone bosses can, uh, like, they're, they're key blasts, so Gohan can nullify them. How much do we eat here? Only 191, yeah, see. We're, we're fine. Even if that was, like, the first attack, we wouldn't have taken much damage from that super attack, so. Very nice. Um, I forget how much exactly, like, that extra 70 versus extra 70 for 70 percent adds to his defense um but we, we would have survived there either way so there we go all right now they're getting getting an attack off i'm kind of just doing like speed runs at this like uh it's we're not really in a challenging scenario here right like we're, we're just kind of beaten up on this poor cell <laughs> like uh you know maybe we need to take this uh fight out of the showcase i don't know it's still harder, probably, than, uh, like, I don't know, like, is this fight harder than the core? That's the question, is, like, what do you guys think? Is first form Cell harder than the core? I, I'd say it's pretty similar, except for Cell doesn't have, like, a build-up phase. Like, that core has that, you know, build-up phase against the army for a couple turns. I'd say, like, that's the main difference between the two phases. All right, let's throw Goku back in slot one. We can grab all that key right there. We can grab these for the LR in the middle. We already know that they'll survive a super attack. Well, maybe. We're at lower HP this time. Ah, eh, whatever. We'll, we'll find out. Um, you know, we're at 7 out of 7 activated, which is nice. Cool. All right, um, let's grab that. Actually, these. That'll give us just a little bit more healing, uh, just in case. So we'll see what happens here. Uh, I do appreciate that this guy has kind of given a little bit of new life to the Super Saiyan 4s. Uh, the nice thing about that unit, right, is that they do have their guard on turn 1, but other than that is once you fuse with them, they have the attack break. And a lot of these fights throughout the future um, red zone, the enemies aren't attacking a ton. Um, like, Fusion Zamasu is the one that attacks the most in his first phase, and, you know, that definitely is, like, unrelenting. But we are type advantage in that first phase, right? Like, this unit's physical, um, you know, Merge Zamasu is int, so that definitely helps. Um, but then once we get to the actual, like, Fusion Zamasu, or, like, the, the Corrupt Zamasu, uh, that guy doesn't attack very often. So if you can just kind of find a slot to hide these guys where there's maybe just one attack, uh, you can put them in front of it, and as long as you can get an 18 key super attack, you can attack break it, and then they're not taking any damage at all. And they're providing, like, a ton of links to this guy. Um, do we survive here? Barely. Uh, we'll see what happens with this guy right here at the end. Uh, I, I don't expect much. Again, this guy's pretty old. Maybe like 60k per normal or something like that. Um, oh, 160k. Well, if we'd gotten a second super attack, it probably would have been down a little bit. Um, let's, let's hop in one more time here. All right, here we go again. Uh, of course, we got the uh, friend and leader rotation. It can't be a uh, real red zone video if we're not getting, like, the friend and leader in the same rotation here. So, um, mine is actually looking a little bit better here because um, I'm link level 10 and the friend is not. So, even though mine's only 79% and the friend is rainbowed, um, I'm, like, right on his tail. I'm actually at higher attack and only bare, like, what is that, 500 less defense. So, we're, we're going to throw mine in slot one right here. We'll grab all that. Uh, we can grab this STR key on the side for them. And then, I mean, uh, we'll see how much damage we do here. Like, if my Goku double supers, if the friend double supers, if, like, the GT2 in the middle give us, like, a quad super. All right, this is good. How much do we take here? Yeah, 285. Like, uh, that is the that is the most damage that this Goku can take. Is turn one, slot one, super attack on the first attack, and uh, 285. I mean, that's, that's child's play for this guy. Uh, so, yeah, uh, but... I don't even remember what I was talking about at this point, like, where, where I've left off, but, um, as far as, like, the core, like, versus this guy, I would say the core, um, like, the, the final phase of the core is very similar to this guy, uh, but the core has that build-up phase, and to some extent, the build-up phase can be helpful because it allows your characters, you know, get built up, get some super attacks in, get some hits in, whatever they need, right, um... But at the same time, it can be a little bit annoying, just depending on what the core, or what the army does. Because sometimes the army can just be really annoying and, like, double super you every single turn, and they're just, like, constantly hitting you with these debuffs. Like, that can be annoying. Um, it's usually not going to kill you, but, you know, going into the core debuffed is definitely not good. You know, imagine if you just walked into this fight, right, and, like, half of your characters were just debuffed. Like, obviously, that would be really annoying. Again, it's basically the same. Um... 
But uh, one thing about this guy, right, is that you can nullify his super attacks. So, you know, you can't nullify the core super attack. You can only dodge it. Um, since this guy does a beam super attack, he does the Kamehameha, you can, uh, you can nullify it with a lot of characters. There are a lot of characters with beam blast nullifications. And that is, like, a very major thing that you can do in this red zone is nullify those. So, like, we can put Gohan here in slot one. And I'm not super nervous about it because he does have the 50% chance to nullify super attacks. Uh, we can grab these... Then we can grab the tech orbs here. Oh, nice. We get nine. Nine is really good. That gives us, what is that, 90% on super attack for this guy? So we'll take it. Yeah, 85k is definitely quite a bit, but, you know, had there been a super attack there, I was confident that this guy could have nullified it. So th th that's kind of my decision behind doing that. Um, again, we're super effective against all types at, what, you know, 24 keys. So we'll, we'll take that. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, you know, it, it is what it is, right? There's the heal. Uh, we already know that if these guys get super attacked in the middle, they'll take like 400k. And they might actually take more because I don't think we have Saiyan Roar active here. So they, they might take a little bit of damage if they get super attacked in the middle. <laughs> By a little bit, I mean a lot. They might take a lot of damage. But we'll see. Um, it, it just depends. There's a double super attack. Can you give us a triple, boys? Uh, they do, but not really. Alright, 400k. So 35, 35. Okay. Uh, Vegeta, if you want to give us an additional, you know, give us the double super again, only take 60k, I would appreciate that. Um, he did get more orbs this time. Okay, nice, we'll take that. Um, so we should be below, like, 50k, 40k, something like that on the, on the normals. I don't think he could survive a super attack, but... Oh, we're at double digits, nice! Well, I mean, let's find out, I guess. Uh, dodge it? No? 451, alright, well, I think we've seen enough. Like, uh, I mean, obviously Vegeta wasn't, like, I, I was clowning on Cell here a little bit. You know, he did catch me here, but, I mean, he didn't catch Super Saiyan 4 Goku, so. Let me know what you guys think about Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Let me know if you think Cell or the Metal Cooler Core is harder. Um, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'm going to catch you guys next time.